Oh, you got your mask on. Uh, coronavirus. <laughs> okay. Josh. Hey, welcome back to our stupid rags. It's up, Corbin. I'm Rick. Be safe, kids. And hey, this is a really good mask. They have not endorsed this. This is just one that I got on set on something I was doing, and I've loved it. This is it. Wear your freaking masks. Is that an N95? It is an N95, yeah. Nice. Anyways, today... Uh, they were, uh, the, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. The reason we are uh, like this, I'm, I'm up in the mountains of Los Angeles. It was called no. basically Lake Arrowhead Big Bear. Uh, uh, we're just me and Steph and Leland are chilling up here for a few days, but a new trailer dropped and it's for a new Topsy Panu and Tar Raj, uh, film. Uh, it's called Loop Lapita, Loop Lapita, right? Close enough. Yeah. Um, it's a remake or an adaption of Run... Uh, what was it? Run Lulu Run. Bog Milka Bog? No, it's a <laughs> it's a, a originally a German film. Run. Oh, Run Lu something I think, but it is apparently an original. I've never seen it. Uh, I just know it's an uh, it's either a remake or an adaption of that film. Okay. I think it was from the nineties actually that film. Yeah. Um, but Tapsy Panu, one of our favorite actresses, uh, we think yep. she's so 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 talented. Um, so really excited about this. Uh, I don't know what the synopsis is, but I don't really want to know. So I guess we'll just be surprised here. Yeah, let's just jump in. All right, three, two, one. दुनिया से मार खाने की हमें आदत हो गई थी. इसलिए हमने दूसरे को ही अपना पेन किलर बना लिया. उसके लिए it was love at first sight. और मैं wow, the cinematography. अब बस पाँव टिकाना चाहती थी. उसमें होगा पचास पचास क्या लाख पचास लाख पचास लाख और एक यूजलेस बॉयफ्रेंड की जान मेरे भरोसे अब इस बार लाइफ और डेथ का सवाल है आप हेल्प करोगे कि नहीं ऐसा क्यों हो रहा है कैसे हो रहा है सर्कल ऑफ लाइफ सत्या तो जिंदा है अभी तक तो सत्या फिर से जिंदा है And I have to save him this time. Chup Satya, yeah. Oh, and so it's like a sci-fi. Don't think about it. 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 trailer <laughs> Netflix does it say release okay. date hold on does it say release date um, um no it just said watch on any device February 4th February 4th I said just saw in the description okay cool what cool, a cool, cool. well cut trailer like when we talk about that like, is so interesting when we talk about like how nowadays you know making trailers is an art form uh because yeah. they what they do they they know how to cut everything so it kind of seamlessly goes together and keeps you intrigued right. but also doing it right. to music to um and this looks like a very um 
stylized kind of uh, filming um, uh, in the way they do it. And it also looks like a very interesting story, almost like Groundhog Day-ish is, is a vibe I'm getting of like, they're going to have to keep repeating until they, uh, until they get it right, I guess. I don't know. It, I, I, it looks very original. It looks quirky. It looks fun. It looks very original. Um, there, it looks like it has that a combination of both really ridiculous, funny moments as well yeah. as some poignant, deep moments. Looks I, like, it looks very, very unique. Looks like it has a, a good action as well as sound. Uh, there was some great uh, yeah. sound moments in there when he shot him. Uh, a couple of the punches were really, really nice. Um, yeah, and obviously we've never seen the original of whatever this film is, so I don't. Obviously, we don't know what's going on. Probably won't see it before that you know this comes out. Um, so if you guys obviously know, do not tell us what's <laughs> what's going to happen in this film, please. Um, but loop, uh, th- which makes me think it's one of those kind of things that kind of happens over and over again, right? It's the name, right, right, right. Loop, loop, right. Beat that loop. When a boyfriend loses yeah. a mobster's cash, Savi races against the clock to save the day. If you, if only she can break out of the curious cycle of dead ends. Is the synopsis? Yeah, I'm intrigued. I'm very intrigued. Ooh, hold on. Let's see here. Okay, so the director is the writer of Engrazy Medium, which we saw in Mumbai with no subtitles. So, <laughs> it's a good no, point. we did. We had our personal translator in Drani in between the both of us going, "Okay, well, he said this. Okay, well, he said this." And we never reviewed it because we didn't feel like we had barely seen the film to be able to Correct. review that, just so you guys know. But he is apparently – oh, he's also the writer – oh, sorry. I'm looking at the I'm looking at the writer, which is why it came up. Same writer as that film. The director is – his name is Akash Baidia. Yeah, I don't – we don't that's know. The, that's the director, so it's the same writer. Same writer as um, uh, that film. You know, it had it had some uh, like some of the quirky, fun vibes of Ludo a little bit. It had a little yeah. splash of that in there, yeah. right? Uh huh. But so original, and you're absolutely right. The 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 cinematography, the cutting of this trailer, the sound, it, it looks, it just look. I'm intrigued. I really would like to watch it. And the acting looked great, of course. Uh, Topsy, obviously, we you know we love Topsy from there. We think she's a yeah. phenomenal, phenomenal actress, and she always, to my knowledge, does unique work. Uh, in terms of she likes to pick more interesting projects most of the time um, mm-hmm. than the typical Bollywood style of, you know, just making right, a lot of right. money. She likes to pick unique projects, and I like that. Or projects that will challenge her or different from stuff she's already tried. Um, and, yeah. and this other guy, I don't think we've never seen him in anything, but he looks odd. That guy in the beginning with the beard looked I thought it was um, BJ Sadapathy for a second, but it's like this old guy with a beard. He looks like he's like a theater trained classical actor, honestly. Yeah, he did. I I thought I recognized him at first and I was taking a little bit of a closer look at his face. Um, Oh, okay. It looks like his name is Dab. God, I can't pronounce that. Dabiandu. But he was in. Um. Lutera, he was a friend. He was a friend. He was in Lutera, Varun's friend, and then apparently he was in Dev Diaz Chuni. I don't remember any of these parts, uh, but those are obviously a Black Friday. He was in apparently. Um, wow. McBull, he was apparently Monsoon Wedding. Wow, good uh, grief that we've seen, we've absolutely seen him multiple yeah, times. Yeah, I'm wondering if he's more been more of like a supporting actor, but he looks strong. He and looks he probably like he was looks different. Film. He probably he probably looks different in this film. Um, yeah. And you know her choices. You mentioned Topsy's yeah. choices. The she reminds me a lot in the difference of her style and the direction she likes to go. She her choices kind of remind me of um, a, a Yushman. Yeah. 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 Y- Yushman. Very, very kind of similar. Yeah. Outside I, the box. I not feel like predictable. Yeah, I totally agree. A Yushman. I feel like. Um, he has his like own genre now, and it's something that always has a message in it. And that's like his yeah. that's yeah. like his shtick. He wants to have a message in his film, uh, but he's a phenomenal actress, and he always but, makes unique films. But quirky, because like 
uh, Amir Khan always has a message, but he doesn't go the realm of the quirky. He may have silly in there, but he doesn't yeah. go offbeat. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm quite intrigued. I think everything about that trailer looked really good from the music to the cinematography to, to the acting yep. to the direction of everything. It's a Great well, trailer. well cut trailer. Uh, looks like it Great comes trailer. out February 4th. Uh, God, February is filling up. And unfortunately, it looks like all this stuff is coming to OTT again. Uh, you know, so we're getting, understandably. OTT, we're getting OTT releases and not theatrical, which makes me wonder about the um, Fafa film that was supposed to come at the beginning of February. Remember that unique one? Yeah, I, it's, it's either going to go to OTT or they're going to push I it push to it. March because I think it's pretty obvious that we've got to... I think we'll see the peak globally of Omicron here in the next two weeks or so, and then it won't start to taper till beginning of February. And I don't think anybody wants to risk their box office until this is cleared out. So, yeah. like, like, like I have felt the whole time, we'll ha we'll see numbers finally cascading down by like Valentine's Day. So the first two weeks of February, I think any film there is going to go OTT or push to March. Yeah, but this one looks quite, quite good. Let us know what you thought about it. And if you've seen the original, do not spoil it for anybody, please. Yeah, please, uh, please. Because obviously if this is an adaption or a remake, a lot of you might know the ending, but do not share it, please. <laughs> it's down below. Just